weeks, my friend brings his Wii U over to my house to play Smash Brothers. While playing, we typically trash talk and poke fun at each other. My four-year-old daughter loves to watch us and comments on how we're doing. One day, I was pretty handily beat two stock in about a minute. What's that mean? Uh, you Griffin? had two lives, and you got knocked off the map by you know Ness's big uh, baseball bat swing, probably. My friend, excited in his win, called me a fucking scrub. Excited by my devastation, my daughter turned to me and shouted quite loudly, You fucking scrub. <laughs> How do I get my daughter to love me again and respect my premium game skills? And should I worry about her swearing? Probably not, right? That's from Sulking in Smashville slash Denver. I think you need to worry about you being a fucking scrub. Yeah, that's a problem, huh? You're so quick to assign blame to everybody else in this situation, except for yourself to, for getting fucking completely dunked on in Final Destination. Like, L to P maybe a little bit? Like, maybe before you start throwing stones, look at your own glass house and how quickly it shatters under the you know salvo of Falco's punches. Especially something. when you talk about your daughter respecting your quote-unquote premium game skills. Uh, yeah, it kind of sounds like you got put in the toilet. Yeah, yeah. and like maybe your daughter is now the daughter of your friend. Yeah, if it sounds like, yeah. If, if my daughter started calling me a fucking scrub, i tell her to pick up a controller and back up those words. 1v1 me. If you're going to talk shit, you better 1v1 me, but and, and we'll kind of see who is the best at Smash Brothers. I don't understand what button punches in that game. It's always mm -hmm. been a mystery to me. My daughter could probably beat me through randomness, so this may not be a great tack, but like, still, 1v1 me, daughter. And to be fair, uh, Justin did teach his beautiful daughter, Charlie, my, my niece who I love very much, to tell me, her uncle, who loves her very much, that she is going to kick his ass. So that is a thing that now I live with all the time. I've been teaching my daughter to curse for a long time, and I hope that I never reach a point where I regret it. And perhaps I will, but you guys can take heart in teaching your children to curse, confident in the knowledge that it, if it ever dawns on me that it was a huge mistake, then I can kind of get warn you away. I can yeah. be the lighthouse on on the Isle of Cursing, and I can ward your ship into safer waters. We'll um, have about two and a half years. Like exactly. you'll be able to travel back in time, so to speak, to us and say, "Don't make the same mistakes I did." I'm just going to teach my son weird cuss words. Okay, not the main ones, but like, you know, piss. <laughs> <laughs> That's like the like, only like one. What was the last time you said unironically bastard? You know what I mean? Yeah. 